So here in Sneedsbury, North Carolina, the name Rookie Davis is a very popular name. So Rookie Davis went to high school here at Dixon High, and he was drafted to the major leagues. And it's pretty awesome because now he and his beautiful wife have opened up two companies. And we're here at Swing Away, and they're going to tell us all about what they're about to open here. Um, we're really excited about it, and we're going to go inside right now and find out all about what he has to offer. So I am so honored to be here with Rookie and Allison Davis, and we are here at their new facility called Swing Away in Sneeds Ferry, North Carolina. Their grand opening is tomorrow, so we're gonna hear about that along with why they decided to open this facility here in this area. So why don't you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, so growing up, um, you had the water park, you had mini golf, bumper cars, or the beach, um, or if you could get into a pool or two. Um, <laughs> I'm not a big fan of the beach, growing up so close to it. Um, so, you know, the water park is gone, everything is gone, and on a rainy day, there's nothing for kids to do, right. or adults for that matter, tourists. Um, so we wanted to bring something here that would give kids um, insight into different things. So baseball, softball, and golf. You know, I grew up with North Shore right up the road, and the first round of golf I played, I was 21 years old. And had I had a, a place like this whenever I was younger, maybe I would take up golf a little bit sooner. Um, but yeah, just bringing something for kids and adults to be able to have a good time. Sunshine, rainy day, doesn't matter. I know you haven't talked about it, but um, you were actually recruited at a high school. You went to Dixon High here locally and um, it's really cool to hear how you were recruited from here and then you came back here to open this up. So where were you recruited and what did you do? So you can tell a little bit about that. So I born and raised here, uh, went to Dixon High School. Um, I signed to go to East Carolina University uh, to play baseball. And in 2011, I was drafted by the Yankees. Um, I spent from 2011 until 2015 there. Um, I was traded to the Cincinnati Reds. I was there from 2016 through 2018, and then 2019 with the Pirates. Um, I was getting ready for another season, COVID happened. And so, stayed here, worked out. I actually opened a baseball and softball academy up in Jacksonville, North Carolina, as a way to stay busy, but also a way to work with kids. It's something that I've always wanted to do, is own my own facility. And what is that called? The Davis Academy. Davis academy. Yes, so we're actually in the process right now of moving into a bigger location. So, you know, once I got home and got around that, the urge to play kind of left. And I always told myself when the day comes that I'm not willing to do everything I need to is the day to walk away. So now we have different ventures and we, we have different things that we want to do, which is, as you know, competitive still. So I enjoy it. <laughs> That's awesome to hear. So this facility is um, great for people who already play, but mm -hmm. people who want to learn and want to do um, and try different things. Allison, do you have um, some background in like, do you just go for it and try it? Or did you play? Do you use the golf machine? Like, what do you do in here? Sure, so I played softball in high school. Okay. Um, Rookie gives me a couple of lessons here and there <laughs> just in the living room at home because, you know, I don't swing the right way. Right. Um, I try to play golf with him as well. We play as much as we can over at North Shore. Um, but yeah, I think it's really great for beginners, people who have played in the past, the really cool thing about the hit track specifically is mm -hmm. that you can play against the field of your own skill level. So oh. I would play um, probably a softball high school level and Rookie could play on my team as well, but he could play against the professional field. That's really so nice. So when I'm hitting, I'm obviously not gonna hit it as far or as fast. So I may be able to get on base the same way he's able to get on base. <laughs> we'll just be playing against a different field. Yeah, you'll get a little extra. Exactly, that's I might nice. have a little bit of boost on yeah. there. That's yeah, nice. just so we can play together and still be competitive. Yeah, that yeah. is really cool. So uh, one of the things that I'm 
really impressed by is that I own some Airbnbs and two minutes down the road are people who come here and visit and really don't know what to do. And I always feel bad when it rains and people come out here and they spend their whole week and the whole week it rains. So um, I'm excited that this will give people an opportunity to do something different. So I'm sure um, not just me, but everybody who owns vacation rentals will want all of your information to share with the people who stay at their facilities. So tell us what the rules are with that and how you're gonna work people who wanna come and, and try it here. Cause when it rains, I'm sure you're gonna be- Right. <laughs> so right now it is through our website, swingawaync.com. Okay. Um, you can book, uh, you know, uh, Hit Tracks Bay, you can book a golf simulator bay through there. The pricing is listed right online. We do have rental clubs, so if you're on vacation, you forgot to bring them, we do have them here. Um, and then we will be accepting walk-ins as well. Um, that's kind of dictated on the schedule and what we have available. Um, but for that, it's just a first come, first serve. If, you know, you show up and the bay is open in an hour, we go ahead and put you down and and that way it's a little bit of an easier transition for people. You know when to be here. We won't have wait times, um, oh, you know, awesome. just to make it a little easier and a little more clean cut for them. Good, that is awesome. Well, thank you so much for having me. It was great seeing you thank guys. You for thank you for coming. No problem.